All right, guys, so now we're in the single X position, right? We've gone from the butterfly, we've gotten to the single X position. We've got our overhook here. Now we're gonna look at uh, a sweep and a submission, as well as a stand-up pass option from here. Uh, and then we'll also look at the transition from this single X to the X guard, which is the most popular uh, X guard entry. Um, so we're gonna start here. We're gonna have our hips elevated. We wanna maintain control. I wanna be in a position where I could literally be relaxed here, but elevated. And if he tries to step anywhere, he's gotta carry all of my weight and it's gonna be very tiring for him, all right? So from here, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to do what we call a one, two, three sweep, all right? So we're gonna go out, in, and then we're gonna elevate our hip higher. This foot here is gonna tap the back of his hamstring and I'm gonna basically break his knee out towards the back to get the sweep, okay? So we're gonna go one, two, three, sweep, all right? I'm gonna maintain my elbow next to his heel, and then I'm going to wrap the foot, all right? Um, once I wrap the foot, we're gonna attack a foot lock, which I'm gonna show you from a different angle so we can see it. All right, so from here, we've got the position. We're gonna go one, two, three for the sweep. I'm gonna cup the calf, scoot my hip out just a little bit this way, not out this way, but back this way to create some space here for my hand to come through. From here, I wanna maintain connection between the base of my shin and my knee. I wanna be pinching. I have the foot wrapped here uh, in gi. I really like to grab my far lapel. The one thing that a lot of guys miss on the footlock is uh, what we call the motorbike, right? When you ride a motorcycle, you rev the engine by rotating here. If I go just straight like this into the footlock, the flat part of my wrist is on the Achilles. So it's not gonna put the ideal pressure. It's gonna be spread out over a, a section like this wide. However, if we rev the engine and rotate, now the bone, he's already feeling the bone applied to the Achilles, all right? So that's gonna dial it in just quite a bit tighter. I'm gonna tuck my elbow here, and then I'm gonna look up to the sky to get the tap, all right? So again, once he falls, I wanna cup the calf, pull it up into my armpit, scoot my hip back a little bit. It's gonna create the space to get my hand in. I'm gonna grab my own collar. The higher on my collar I can grab, the better. I bring my hips back in, keep this all pinched. I rev the motorcycle. I hide the elbow, I look up. If you're tight enough, sometimes they're gonna tap like that before you even look your head up, but you wanna look your head up this way, not up to the sky, above your head, towards the crown of your head. All right. So that's the sweep and foot lock from the single X position.